Hey y'all, Winnie here. Um, this is Winnie with Winnie, where you go Winnie, cause you with me. So, me and my babies are on another road trip. So this is our second road trip this year. Right now we are back in Minnesota. Love Minnesota, love coming here. We're here for family, but we did road trip here and we're probably gonna hit a couple of different places on the way back. Um, but I wanna talk about something that my cousin brought to my attention last night. She told me that I take risks and she was talking about how it's good um, because basically for those people who don't take risks, what tends to happen a lot is that you want to do something, but you're too afraid to do it because doing it will cause you to have to like get into an uncomfortable position, AKA a position that's risky, right? That can pose risks to like what you're used to and all these other things. Um, so I was thinking about that and I was like, yeah, I'm the type of person who is like, if it's risky, but I feel like I really want to do it, then I'm going to go ahead and take that risk. Like risk is worth it. Hey, look at me. Risk is worth it because um, on the other side of that risk is like, this sense of euphoria, like I did it, like I did it, I made it through, or I made it halfway there. It, there's a, this sense of accomplishment and it's like the most beautiful thing ever. So um, why am I here? Like, what do I want y'all to know? What do I want to tell y'all? I want to tell y'all to not be afraid to take risks. I want to tell y'all to do the things that you really want to do. I've been, I've been doing it. Do I do everything? No, because some of the things I want to do, they're really genuinely stupid, okay? And if I do them, like, <laughs> I risk something called death. <laughs> and I'm risky, but I'm not daredevil -y. I'm, I'm not. Some of y'all are daredevils. If you're a daredevil, take that risk, because you'll probably make it. Me, I'm not. Um, but take risks, y'all. And one thing I want to tell you about when you're taking risks is very, be very mindful of who you share your risks with or the things that you want to do that have the potential to cause risk because some people they they don't get it they don't understand that when we're stepping into things that are risky that are dangerous that require a lot of attention that require a lot of energy some people will say things out meaning well um for me those things i take a lot of road trips those things are like aren't you afraid aren't you gonna get tired aren't you like you know people say things like that and i'm like dude no like shh, shh, quiet 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 if i got faith you should have faith too if i'm confident you should be confident too um because people will kill your confidence people will kill the little bit of hope the little bit of faith that you do have when you are about to take risk and there is no killer no killer of any goal any dream any wish that is like negative people and it's it's not even intentionally negative people so i know a lot of us might think like oh like this isn't a negative person well some people are negative but it's just like in a less um obvious way it's more subtly negative so like for instance the people who i would say oh yeah i'm getting ready to like take a trip across all these states east and west or take a trip that's like 18 hours to minnesota they would be like aren't you scared like aren't you scared that you're gonna get into an accident aren't you scared of these things it's like yeah i know that there's a possibility of those things but there's a possibility of those things even when i'm at home so for me, I think about the fact that, you know, all I got to do is prepare myself. And um, since I'm here talking about this, I do want to tell you like the one way to prepare yourself. So a really good way to prepare yourself is to get mentally ready for anything that requires a risk. OK, so when I'm taking road trips, one thing that I do to get ready is I remind myself that, hey, you're about to take a really long trip and you're going to have to listen to your body. You're going to have to like listen to your spirit and everything because there's different types of people in different places there are different rules in different places there there's just a number of things there's different animals running across the road in different places there's like you know we do get tired and this is just a lot of things that happen but I always have to mentally prepare myself and I have to tell myself okay this is where I'm going this is what I'm doing I have to like mentally get to a place that's like it's okay like i'm gonna be all right and then i every doubt the fears the worries like i try my best to wipe them out of my mind if i can't get them out of my mind then one thing that i do is as soon as they start to like try to come through i'm like nope i'm not listening i don't want to hear that and i combat it with something good something positive um so shout out to my cousin for talking to me and reminding me that i'm a risky person 
that I like to take risks. They're good risks though. They're good risks that are gonna create lifelong, lifelong memories in me and my children. But um, yeah, I wanna encourage y'all to take risks. Take risks, get yourself in a mental place of like being okay with it. Only talk to the people who know you and who know what you're capable of and who know that you won't do anything if you don't have confidence and comfort in it. People who are gonna also have confidence in you having confidence and being comfortable with you being comfortable. Um, a lot of new people, y'all, I'm gonna be straight up. People were calling me, y'all. Like there were people who were calling me while I was on the road. There were people who called or wanted to talk to me before I was getting ready to leave and I was like, these are not the type of people that I can answer the phone for at this moment because they don't understand me yet. They don't get the type of person I am yet. So they're going to have questions that are skeptical, you know, and then they're, they're going to, they, they are reasonably skeptical. Okay. But they're not the type of questions that I want to answer. They're not the type of conversations that I want to have, um, excuse me, before I take big trips or before I jump into some risk, like even with business and stuff, y'all, there are some people with some conversations, et cetera, that I just don't want to talk to that I just don't want to deal with when I'm in the midst of something you know certain so anyways y'all my baby's getting into shit so I'm finna go get her because we finna get kicked out of here if I don't they gonna be like y'all got to go um yeah and I don't know I'm gonna share my trip with y'all and I hope that I get to share a couple of these different journeys that I take in my life with y'all Hey, as I always say, God is good, life is good, we're amazingly blessed. Love y'all.